happening to uh, what we've been able to do right is that while we have a clear idea or a vision in terms of where we want to be 18 months from now right and essentially what do we uh, get when we get, get to that point right for us it is very important to kind of break down the 18 months in terms of different phases right and we follow the quor- quarterly planning process with okrs right so it's very clear so every quarter we are able to we really understand the problems that we are facing and prioritize on those and basis that plan the quarter right to kind of uh, either put down these fires or to kind of double down on growth in certain areas or to kind of build a uh, say new products per se right it really helps us kind of put a lot of structure there uh, we've actually implemented okrs across the entire team so this is not just at a company level but it's also at an individual team level right so sales success support uh engineering xyz essentially every team in the organization today is involved in the planning exercise while the three of us will oversee the entire exercise uh the individuals on the team are actually responsible of uh, that reflection and then creating the okrs for the coming quarter keeping in mind what the company wants to achieve so this is really helped us also understand as an organization who in the team can kind of take on that ownership and kind of contribute at that layer as well right and for a company at our stage given that we are a fairly small team plan to grow our team size maybe 3 to 4x in the next 18 months so keeping that in mind we felt that this was the right time for us to kind of ensure that everyone is aligned uh, from an okr standpoint because as we add in new people to the organization everyone comes and contributes to, to the current infrastructure that we've set in place